putting that in. Show me the video, bro. I need to see it. When you're young, not much matters. When you find something that you care about, then that's all you got. When you go to sleep, at night you dream of running. When you wake up, it's the same thing. It's there in your face. You can't escape it. Sometimes when you're young, the only place to go is outside. That's just it. Running. This is what I love. Take that away from me, and I really got nothing. <laughs> If you play PC Minecraft, you should no, check no, out no, a really this cool out. server called WinCraft. It's the IP is play.wincraft. W-Y-N-N dot com. You should play it. Do you have a it's girlfriend? Cool. Yeah. <laughs> what a <sell. laughs> You have an L light. <laughs> what are you doing? Let's go. Recording. Are you recording the initiation? Oh, oh yeah. Are you recording my body boxing session? <laughs> Hi. I'm Carter McCart. I used to be a runner on the cross country team at Franklin. I got injured in the summer, but I decided to make this documentary about the team. There's a lot of ways. Then I just haven't seen the whole deck, so don't get mad at me. Stun it, stun it. It, so why are you criticizing the deck? I'm not it's criticizing the deck. The gathering, Carter. I'm just analyzing the middle of the workout. Oh, They're talking about magic. Can you believe that? He's mad. He's mad. You literally were like the biggest threat after. We're going full nerd, aren't we? Sometimes that happens. You're going to play magic. You can watch Dune. It's going to, oh my god. Yeah, clap it up. Good team cap. That was incredibly awkward. None of you guys talking. Lincoln drop out of the race. Lincoln did drop out. For oh, they're scared. scared. Reason they're scared. unknown. Reason they're unknown. Scared. The playing, reason's not unknown. Right they're, right right they're playing Jenga. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure that's just what they're doing at school. But, we could well, go and just beat them at Jenga. They have to stay Lincoln at school for the first day for oh, academic yeah. reasons. Oh guys. right, because they're all so small. Yes. We're walking three kilometers. She's a qualifier. We're not here to, you know, we don't all have to have the race of our lives. As long as we all just have a solid race. Nobody blows up. You don't have to PR by 20 fucking seconds. As long as we all just have a solid, good race, we can still win this thing, right? You know, we're here to beat them. Yeah, yeah. Sir. Right. Balls out! No fear! Balls out! No fear! Balls out! No fear! Let's go, boys. What's Donna? Donna is not strictly. Let's go, Donna. Move it down that hill. I thought it was going to wipe out. He's going to the fifth hole. Oh, oh shit. Let's go, Donna. Let's go, Donna. I do have an uh, interesting story actually for your video here. Um, <laughs> Freshman year, I, uh, I got a sweatshirt for my brother, I, or maybe I stole it. And he said I could only keep it if I got top 10 at the night meeting, and I got 10th. I mean, I missed it last year, but still got 10th this year. Kind of kind of made it a goal of mine, so I'm really happy I was able to, able to get it. I don't know if that last lean at the end actually did anything. Maybe that guy, I don't know if I beat that guy, but I got 10th, so. Yeah, I'm pretty happy about that. You know, I quit soccer before coming into high school. Um, that's a long story. But anyways, I was just looking for, I wanted to stay with a sport, stay with sports. And I, cross country was the only one, I think, with a practice time that was, like, accessible and on the website. So I just showed up. Yes. I need to get <laughs> yeah, so guys. Thanks, Cooper. Thank you, Cooper. Thank you. Cooper. Yeah, that was incredible. In the box. Yeah. <laughs> you know, uh, starting a race, getting online, I'd like to think that I have a defined strategy in my head. It's kind of, it varies from race to race, um, but I feel like the overarching theme I want to have in my head is really just like, all right, I'm, I'm ready to have a blast. I'm ready to compete. <laughs> Let's go back, skew it up with them! <laughs> Let's go, Gwilym! Let's 
go, Oscar! And then rolling down to the beach was rolling. Oh shit! Get it! It's Max. Max back on the cam. Back again, as per usual. I think that my favorite things about running is is like our our team. Um, that's like a little cliche to say, but the team dynamic that that we have, I think, is really really good. And and just being able to run around after like a long school day with those kids on the track or at at, at Mount Tabor is just. I don't know, there's something special about that. And we, we share this kind of special bond of like, oh yeah, it sucks when we race. Um, and you can kind of like share that together uh, with people. Come on, you got to run, you got this. Get up there, Rowan, let's go, let's push it. Sebastian, get this guy, Sebastian, let's go, let's go, push it up the hill, let's go. Zephyr, you're killing it. Let's go, Zephyr. Get up there, Zephyr, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I honestly think that one of the main differences between us and them is that, you know, the people that have come and gone from our sport and our school, we're all from the same area. We don't recruit people in, and we all just come together to school every day, and then after school, we all come and we run and we have fun together. And I think that that difference in community is really what sets us apart from those other schools. It's so beautiful. <laughs> I like to say that the, the varsity boys had a great day today. I think, I don't know, I didn't really ask them how they did because they seemed kind of Oops, so they, just moody. Moody. they kind of seemed a little moody a little bit, so I didn't ask. Camera's panning too fast. Right now we're at Popeyes. Um, Paul's currently eating his, his chicken sandwich. I'm gonna have to go get my order. What happens with if my order come comes up? Come get the side section. Come get the come get the cross section, bro. <laughs> yeah, you see that? She, that wow, shit wow. My approach to like after a bad race is often I'll take a day or two to like really internalize how it feels and sort of figure out what I did wrong, where I could improve. Um, it's the biggest struggle would probably be, yeah, confidence because, you know, a bad race can really set you back and, um, you know, really lower your self-esteem and it's, it's, it's hard to train to the season if, if you're... Uh, if you have a bad motor. Um. Running comes with some low points. It comes with some very high points, but just like any other sport, it comes with low points too. And that idea, that central idea that you only lose when you don't get back up, that's, that's the thing that really like motivates me to, to keep going at it. But again, one of the reasons we're good, one of the reasons the PIL is good is because we're all good running against each other. Be very thankful that Lincoln is hyper-motivated to kick some ass, that Wilson is good. love getting new kids every year. We love uh, seeing how they turn out and trying to, as a team, really uh, helping them become the best version of their running selves that they can be. It's so fun to have new kids every year because it's just so many new characters to, um, to talk with and to learn about. I find their their advances in their running are more profound than people who've been running for a long time. Um, I think it's really exciting to see people come in not really being confident with themselves with running and, and especially to see the people that um, start out thinking that it's nothing important and then end up really loving the sport and I think that that's super cool. On the end of the season, how would you mark your progress? Are you, are you, okay? are you good with your progress? Or you, how, how do you feel about your progress this season? Uh, I think I improved. years. Funny years. Hi! How are you live? Finish strong! You got a minute, 20 seconds faster? Yep.
Oh my god. So like, <sighs> you know, when I joined the team, you know, it was pretty cool because like I already knew what was going on, but like, you know, I didn't know I was gonna be like running every day yet, but it was really cool that I could be with like, you know, all these people that are like so much faster because I went from being like the oldest kid in my school to like the youngest. So it's like a different environment, but you know, the seniors are like really nice to freshmen, like new freshmen, so it's, it's just cool, you know? And you're just like being pushed to go faster. I'm not nearly as good as you guys. Shout out. You were John the Baptist. He is Jesus Christ. I didn't read the Bible. Thank you for the run gum. Uh, I might buy some more later. Can you explain run gum to the camera? It's gum with caffeine. Pretty sick. So what does it do? It makes you faster. Helps you turn. What do you just run? 1627. I ran slower than that. <laughs>